Hi, I'm Cass, and Lee is still not here, although I am home because of uh, the pandemic. Um, but today I was thinking that I could do something um, that I've been wanting to do for this channel. I'm a little bit more artsy stuff. So I am going to be making clay jewelry from a craft kit. So I don't have a overhead ledge like I did for my last video at college. So it's just going to have to be this angle because I don't have a tripod or anything yet. But this is the kit that I was talking about. Um, yeah, this isn't very good, but we're going to make it work. It's called Embellishments Jewelry Kit. And you already saw the stuff that we can make. So here's some liquid Sculpey the instructions and the other stuff and oh here's the glitter I like the glitter a lot so I'll show these up to you up close so that has like a cord for the necklace and the keychain a toothpick and like uh, some flowery stuff in the little yeah and then here is the liquid sculpey and that's backwards because it's a camera of course it is uh and then this is one of the glitters and here's the other one i'm really excited for these because i really like glitter and then here is this mold which hopefully i'll be making a lot of use out of because i do want to start a etsy uh thing shop and sell stuff once I get good at this. Here are the instructions and it tells us what's included and stuff. Also sorry if my camera quality is bad. I um cracked my screen protector um a little while ago and I can't use the back camera right now. Um, because I can't figure out how to angle it, but there's four different, um, things in here that we can make, and I'm thinking about making the opal keychain, which is upside down, so here's, like, the instructions and stuff, so... And so, place a thin layer of liquid Sculpey clear on the bottom of the shape shown, which is this shape, and spread it around with a toothpick. I've never used liquid Sculpey, so I don't really know how this works, if it's like a glue bottle or not, is what I mean. So we're just gonna, nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, maybe it comes... No, it's like a glue bottle. Okay. It's still not coming out. Wonderful. We're gonna have to cut this out. Oh, there we go. A little bit came out, but I don't know how I made it come out. Okay, well, we're having fun. Okay. Okay, so I've given up on the cap, so I'm just going to try and just get out with the toothpick because we are having lots of issues. I don't feel like dealing with it today. Oh, it's very thick. Maybe that's why it's not coming out. Ugh. Is this what liquid Sculpey is supposed to look like? That's weird. Oh no, I missed. Oh no. I thought it would be more like glue. 
like that consistency, I guess. Smells weird too. Oof. I have no idea if I'm doing this correctly. Uh, okay, well, we are having fun, aren't we? It's like clumping together and then breaking. I don't, I don't think it's supposed to do that. Look at this. I don't know if you can see it, so I'm gonna try a few different angles, but I don't think it's supposed to do that. But yeah, it's not. It's not like spreadable at all, it's just clumping. I don't think I like this. Okay, we need a little bit more to finish the small layer. Alright, I think that's good. So now we put this in the oven for three to five minutes. So I'll be back when it's baked. Okay, so here it is baked. Um, I scratched a little bit to see if it was hard, and it was kind of not hard, and then this is all of my, uh, that is the wrong finger, okay, this is all of, like, the, um, where I missed, because I was having difficulty with it, so hopefully that's not toxic, but now we put the glitter in. So we're going to put a little bit more of this in. And then we put the glitter in. So we're going to move that a little bit so that you guys can see. And my dog's coming in. Great. Okay, so now we're going to add a little bit more, I think. Just to cover the layer, you know. Then we'll put the glitter in and stir it all up. So I think, like, that's about good. So now we're opening the glitter. Um, I think, yeah, mm, yeah, it's this glitter, this bluish one. Um, how does one open? Does it, yeah, it does have one of those things. The sticky things, you know what I'm talking about. So, oh, there's three glitters, I thought there was only two. So we have this bluish one and the gold one, both of which you saw, but we also have this white pinkish one, which is the one that we're using for the opals. So we're going to open this and hope it does not go everywhere. And... Mm. sealed very tightly it doesn't have a thing so we're going to cut a little bit of a corner off just big enough to get the flakes out I think I should probably move that and I want to move this so you can oops I missed that's okay. 
just kind of massage it so it doesn't come out. But there is glitter everywhere. Okay. We have a little bit in there, which I don't like, but that's okay. Now we're supposed to stir it. Apparently, it's not a very stirrable substance. I don't know if I got, like, the wrong kind or something. Not the wrong kind, but, like, it's broken is what I mean. It still doesn't really work. That's okay. So we're going to add a little bit more, I think. I am just getting glitter everywhere. That's great. Ah! Okay, well, I got glitter everywhere. It's okay. Everything's fine. Mm. Okay, I'm going to add a little bit more so it's up to the top, I think. Ooh, I think I added a little bit too much. That's fun. Okay, well, let's just... Oh, no, it looks to be pretty much perfect. No, we don't want to cover that bit. Nope. At least it's easy to maneuver. But it's like, it's like oobleck. Like, the consistency of it. I don't like it. And then we're going to put a little bit more glitter. Just so, like, there's enough. Because I want to be able to see it. it. It bakes clear. So. But. But, like, I want a lot of glitter, because I like glitter. I have a glitter problem. Oof. So we're just going to try and kind of poke it in there and kind of fold it. But we don't want it attaching to that. So we're just going to... Okay. It's all clumping with the glitter. So that's fun. Okay, so now... Okay, so I guess this is good. So I'm going to... Mm, I'm going to tape this closed with uh, some of my washi tape that I use for a diamond painting. Which, once it's finished, um, I might show you. Like, I kind of want to do this thing where... Um, I, like, show you all of the things I made, like, in the past couple of months or something. I don't know. I think it would be cool. Um, but, so, we're going to take that closed, and we're going to go put this in the oven for 20 minutes, so I'll be back then.